This morning, you can notice that the streets of downtown Dallas are almost empty. The majority of the residents are at home in containment or doing necessity shopping. They told us on the TV to wear masks, gloves and everything if we want to get out of the house. Considered as part of the countries most affected by the COVID-19, Italy has different containment rules as in the city of Florence. I feel locked up. Classes are taken online. It is difficult to focus, especially if you're a young mom and a student. People are now expecting the stay-at-home order. Before, however, they did not. And that is why the situation worsened to what it is currently. To go outside, we need to have a self-written declaration. The reason justifying you going out need to be valid in case policemen stop you in the street. If you are sick, you need to stay home. Otherwise, you risk up to 12 years in prison. Pharmacies are open, coffee shops as well, because Italians love coffee. Conditions of containment are different everywhere such as in Ivory Coast where the number of cases is growing but life goes on. We are able to freely move around during the day. A few businesses only are closed. Schools as well but most businesses are still open. People who are the most at risk, old people and the sick, have been required to self-quarantine at home. I think that the government took down good measures, even if I would have preferred a general lockdown to avoid the spread of the virus. The government also imposed a curfew from 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. every day to everyone. We are back to Dallas, where Dallas County extends the emergency order through May 20. It is Jessica Vieira for the Richland Chronicle.